In this video, we'll look at the equation for SrOH2 plus H2O. This is strontium hydroxide plus water. We have a metal and some nonmetals. This is an ionic substance here, so we're going to put S. It's going to be a solid, and then water, that'll be a liquid. So strontium hydroxide, when you have a metal and you see it with this OH, this is the hydroxide group. This is going to be a base. So when we put this in water, we would expect that it would dissociate into its ions and we'd get strontiums in group two, so it'd be two plus the whole hydroxide is always one minus. So we'd have Sr2 plus, we'll write Aq, that's dissolved in water, plus we'd have the hydroxide here, OH minus, that would be aqueous as well. And this two means we'd get two separate hydroxide ions for each strontium ion. So this would be the equation for strontium hydroxide dissolving in water. So the strontium hydroxide here, it's producing these hydroxide ions. That's what makes it a base. And we have a list of strong bases. Strontium hydroxide, it's considered to be a strong base, which means it's going to dissociate completely when you put it in water. But there's something you should be aware of with strontium hydroxide. It's not really that soluble in water. If we look at this solubility data, this is from Wikipedia, 0 0.041 grams per 100 milliliters at zero Celsius. Sodium hydroxide, another brace, 418 grams. Almost 100 times more of this will dissolve in water. They're both considered strong bases. The reason we still consider strontium hydroxide to be a strong base and that we end up with these ions here is because although not a lot of it dissolves in water, what does? It's going to break apart into its ions completely. So you put this in water, this much will dissolve per 100 milliliters at 0 degrees Celsius. All of that will dissociate into strontium ions and hydroxide ions. So this is the equation for strontium hydroxide plus water. Sometimes people will put the H2O above the arrow. I really like it down here. And the aqueous here, since we have aqueous, we're saying it's dissolved in water. We don't really need to write H2O again on this side. This is Dr. B with the equation for strontium hydroxide plus water. Thanks for watching.